Hi, I'm Bernie Wild. I'm Susan Wild. And, and we, we enjoy, enjoy going, going to, to the beach. beach. And when we're at the beach, there's a few things that we really like to do. In this video, we're going to share some of the things that we have fun doing when we're at the coast. One thing we really enjoy doing at the beach is something we like doing wherever we're at, and that's watching wildlife. Yeah, we've been able to watch a lot of birds. Recently, we were able to see some bald eagles at the beach, and that's always a treat. I really enjoy that quite yeah, a bit. Yeah, they're beautiful. Yeah, I agree. There are also uh, gulls all over the place. We see them everywhere that we go along the coast. One of the things that's really fun to watch them do is to eat. We've actually watched them uh, fish out uh, crab out of the water and eat them right there on the shore and yeah. that's really neat while they're alive and they're, they're, they're it's fighting. Awesome. They uh, get every single bite out of that crab and nothing goes to waste. It's really fun to watch. Another animal that I really like watching is the seals and the sea lions. They're just amazing. Yeah, they're all over too. We've seen them all up and down the west coast everywhere we've been along the shorelines and out on rocks and things like that. They're just really wonderful to watch. Uh, some people say that they can get a little stinky when they're uh, in close, but uh, we, we don't get that close to them. But we really enjoy listening to them and watching them. It's, it's quite something to see when they're all in huge groups. Yeah, probably my favorite though was the sea otters. When we saw the sea otters, that was so neat. I love yeah, that. Yeah, <laughs> definitely. So if you're at the coast or along some type of beach or something like that, take some time to view the wildlife. It's really a lot of fun. Yeah, if you happen to be there at low tide and can catch some tide pools, that's really neat too. Yeah, we enjoy that quite a bit. We're able to even film underwater sometimes and see some of the sea stars and sea anemones and all that kind of thing. So yeah, it, it can be a great place to view wildlife too. Maybe some people don't think about that at the beach. But yeah, it's a good and thing. Some, something that's not actually wildlife but that's fun to watch at the beach is the dogs playing. <laughs> I, I love watching the dogs run and play in the surf. Barkley's not real excited about it, but uh, he's, he does walk in the, in the surf from time to time. But. Yeah, he's had some fun at the beach. Another thing that we really enjoy doing when we go to the beach is beach combing. We find a lot of rocks, a lot of agates, things like that. Yeah, we found some really interesting uh, <laughs> uh, geometric shaped rocks on one beach. Um, rectangles and triangles, and they were really cool. Yeah, that's really neat. I. I thought that was quite unusual yeah. because we found them all in one like maybe an hour's time yeah. we were able to find many different shapes of rocks and I thought that was really neat so it's always something to, that we come across yeah shells like this yeah. one just found a limpet <laughs> shell not a whole lot of shells on the west coast but there are always some to be found yeah there's there's a lot of driftwood on the west coast I noticed yeah. that so we, we're always finding something wooden or made of rock and sea glass, all kinds of stuff. sand dollars um, quite often. Yeah. It's always fun looking to find the whole sand dollar that's not broken. <laughs> yeah, and we've, we've been on beaches that have them all over the place and, and some extremely tiny that we've found. Very, very small sand dollars and that was really cool. Something unfortunate that we find when we're beach combing is... Uh-oh, here comes uh -oh. the water. <laughs> we're getting wet. Yeah. Uh, we find that we get in. wet a lot when the yeah. tide's coming up. But uh, yes, yeah, one of the unfortunate things that we find when we're beach combing is a lot of trash. Yeah, that's the sad part. Uh, fortunately, we pack it out with us, so it's good in the end, I guess. Yeah. Something else we really enjoy when going to the beach is to attend events. Yeah, things like the one going on behind us now. It's called Circles in the Sand, and a gentleman named Denny Dyke, with the help of a lot of volunteers, come out several times during the summer and create these amazing labyrinth mazes in the sand. And you walk through it, and they're just really beautiful. Yeah, it's a lot of fun, and we enjoy that quite a bit. Another thing is attending sandcastle competitions. We went to a few of those, and they're really neat, seeing the creativity and oh, all of yeah. the work that goes into building such yeah, huge sculptures in the sand. amazing things that they build in a, a really short amount of time, because obviously, you know, the 
tide is only out for so long so they have a very limited window to create these things that are just absolutely beautiful yeah i agree and if you're going to be in a beach or coastal area check the local events calendars to see what might be coming up in your area we don't always hit it right yeah. on but when we do we sure like to attend these types of events something we enjoy doing at the beach that's not actually on the beach is exploring the little beach towns I love the little shops when they have lots of beachy and nautical themed knickknacks and plaques. Of course, we always look for magnets. And you look at hoodies, hoodies. and sweatshirts yeah. and things like that, and I'm always checking out the hats. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> One of the fun things that I really like doing is checking out the local brew pubs and going to the seafood restaurants. Yeah. It's really fresh and good, so I, I'm always looking forward to that when we go to the beach. Yeah, sometimes it makes me wish I liked seafood more. <laughs> Let us know in the comments what your favorite beach town to explore is. Yeah, we'd really like to read about it. Probably our favorite thing about being at the beach is just the energy of the ocean. The sound of the waves, the smell of the salt air, uh, just the whole feeling of being at the ocean. Yeah, especially after we've spent a lot of time inland, maybe at the desert or something like that. It's just really rejuvenating to go over to the ocean without sounding too metaphysical, there, there really is an energy that comes from it. It's just so powerful, and yet it's so calming and peaceful. Yeah. It just, it really just relaxes us, and we, we always feel really good when we're at the beach. It's yeah. just a, one of our favorite things to do, is just to come over and, and relax and, and just take in all the energy. And It's also very special to us, too, because we both lost our moms, and the beach is a very special place. Uh, in, in our memories with our moms so that's that's always yeah. on our mind when we're at the beach those are a few of the things that we like to do when we go to the beach comment and let us know what you like to do when you go and please remember to share subscribe and click on that little notification bell thanks, thanks for, for watching, watching. There's a lot of things that we like taking to the beach, but five in particular. One, we want to make sure that we take water with us because even though we're around all that water, it's salt water and we can't drink it, so we want to make sure we stay hydrated. Another thing is a good windbreaker. I got it all packed up here, easy to carry. I can break it out whenever I want it. The other thing is a good pair of compact, powerful binoculars, so we have that around with us. And I like to bring a hat clip along so that I don't lose my expensive hats in the wind. And then finally, we carry some type of bag, and this might be for beach combing, and more often than not, it's for carrying trash out that we find along the beach. Have you ever gotten crabs at the beach? <laughs> huh? Have you gotten crabs? No. <laughs>